What's up, YouTube? Kevin Wolf123. Done a charity shop video, videos, compilation all together. Uh, this is for someone on YouTube at the moment. Uh, well, obviously, it's for everybody on YouTube, but one guy especially said he wanted a new video, and it's his birthday soon, so I said I'd do one. I went to all the charity shops in the area, including a few that were outside of the area, and there wasn't much around, as you'll see in the video, but I've left it pretty raw so you can see exactly what happens in it. I haven't done much of a voiceover either. I've only done a, done a couple of bits of voiceover because I've left it talking in the video, so you'll get the gist of what's happening. You'll see what I pick up, what I don't pick up, uh, and you'll just see what's in the area. Uh, what else was I going to say? Oh yeah, that was it. Uh, I'm not too sure if you'll like it this way. Um, if you want me to do it in the future, let me know, as in do the video and do a voiceover over the whole lot, or if you like it if I'm talking in the actual video. So I've got the camera on and I'm talking to the camera while walking around. If you like that way, I'll leave it like that. Uh, I think for the boot sale ones, I'll carry on doing a voiceover because it's easier, because you can't hear much when it's at the boot sale. There's too much talking and stuff going on. But yeah, hope you enjoy it. Thanks for watching, guys. Thank you. I'm with my mum today, and she's uh, saying that there's no games in here. I'm talking. Hello, mum, on the camera. Get off the bloody camera. <laughs> there you go. That's my mum. Let's have a little gander. God, it's freezing. Hello. You all right? Wind's blowing you away. Oh. <laughs> oh, see you. We're running now. Oh. Dancing stage mega mix. Oh, Would you mind if I check your games out the back? Uh, no, that's all right. Is that all right? Yeah. Thank you. I normally have a look. There's only one out, you see, so I thought I'd have a little look. Cooking guide, how brain training, loads of brain training. Not many games, usually loads. Paint by DS. Connect adventures. Oh, well, good. Might be before Christmas. Dorian Gray, that's what Jake was on about. I'm sure he was on about that. <clears throat> What's this disc? Usually loads of games, only, there's only about two or three out there. That's what we got. Yeah. People keep oh, look at this. That's, the problem. <laughs> that's from, um, what's that film? Don't ask me. The one in the zoo. With. Uh, I don't know. Me, I'm no, I'm not buying that. that. I'm not carrying that round <laughs> the town. How much are you? How much are they normally? It's over there, isn't it? Yeah, they're 99 pence. Is that right? Yeah, okay, that's cool. Yeah, I'll take those. It's always good to ask if you've got a couple out the back, you know what I mean? Because it's... Yes. Well, it depends who's here. If the yeah. new boss is here, then we Oh, she's a bit strict. Yeah. Some shops won't let you go through there. Don't worry about it. the two-piece, fine, yeah. Make sure the discs are in there. Helps, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you very much. I didn't see anything else over here. No, I'm just looking at the CD. And he got me... Um, you don't need to oh, do... Oh, there's Resistance. There's one game there. You don't I used need... To, I used to like that one. You don't need to do that Ed Sheeran thing. Oh, you don't want me. it now. You got it, have you? Well, no. Apparently, Andy went to London in the records, like he always does. And Charlotte bought... He's he's done a, a double album, vinyl. Okay. For 15 quid. And you, you have to... You get a voucher or something, and you have to burn the CD or something. I don't know. 
Oh, okay. So they they get it for they got it free. Let's have a look in Oxfam. Usually shit in here, but it's well windy. Jesus. Where did that come from? I don't know. I don't normally have any, but yeah, all right. I'll, I'll look in a minute. Doesn't look like there's any. Nah. Box sets. Oh yeah. Do you guys ever sell computer games? You know, like PlayStation and stuff. I've never seen them in it, but I always come in anyway. Okay, so as you can see on the shelf, the yellow uh, Walkman there, I switched the camera off for a second because I was just checking on uh, the internet to see if it was actually worth picking up because some of these Walkmans are only worth like a couple up. of quid, but they wanted three ninety nine for it. Well, Average yeah, price on eBay best. is twenty to fifty four pound. So I thought, you know, for that price, I might as well grab it. What if this works? What is it? Walkman. Well, something you'd have to take part that with, wouldn't you? It's not got a power cable. Hmm. So I doesn't need a power cable. Yeah, but it's for tapes, isn't it? Yeah. Do you know if, if this works or is it? Or do you test it before you put it out on? No idea. Oh, okay. As simple as that. No idea. So you pay three ninety nine. It might not work. Yeah. As long as you keep your receipt. If it doesn't work, you bring it back. Oh, okay. Is it something you want? Yeah. Right for 12 quid, isn't it? Yeah. Sorry. Sorry, mate. You want a table? 20 quid. Don't think there's any games, games there. Are they films? Films. There's books over there. And all films. Maybe there'll be some over here. Let's have a look. Old snooker table. Doesn't look like it. And drop it. Let's go. Have a okay, let's have a look in here. It's always expensive in here, isn't it? Yeah, they are. I was just having a look on the shelf. Pro Evo 2005, the getaway, 2009. Anything on the shelf? Yeah. Second. Silent Hill again. Just saw that in the last shop. They're not bad prices though, they've got a fiver. Not yeah, that's good for a chair, it. but yeah. Not been in this one before, this is a brand new charity shop. Oh, a few weeks, I ain't been here for a few weeks. Okay. Let's go for a rummage. 
Who else have we been in there? Yeah, I'm just looking. Like a knockoff of Ted. Okay, thank you. PC and computer Sorry about speeding the video up. I had to wait for this guy to get out of the way. He was there for an age. SSX, there's quite a few games here. Not bad prices. What's this game down the back? PGA Tour. Let's have a look at what we've got. Lord of the Jungle, Anna Corner Cobras, Tennis, Toka. That's all right. And then you can see the others. Calm down. <laughs> Tiger Woods, football, football, sports, 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 dancing, sports, sport. What's behind? Oh, look, there's a copy of mm. Cuve Gangna des Millions. Yeah. French, you wants to be a millionaire. Just an empty box, wasn't it? I used to have a Raw 2. The graphics were well good back in the day, but but they are uh, slow, are they as I remember. Or are they, are the bottom in the box? Just looking up here first, there's a few PC type of walls. Awesome. Mm. Nah, that's it. I think they're all DVDs. 24. Yeah. These are PCs, aren't they? More PC here. So I just popped in Burger King with my mum. Thought I'd get her XL. She's seen something. And uh, apparently there's no burgers. So they've opened early to sell burgers and they have no burgers in stock. There's a charity shop we don't go too often. It's Keach Hospice in Catherine Drive. Let's have a gander. Doesn't look like there's much. Ah, things are falling. Sale clearance. Thank you very much. Thank you.
Oh, Thought I'd check the cupboard, and in there is the Pokemon <coughs> game from the last video. It's still there, still eighteen ninety nine. That's never going to go. So I don't know if they'll eventually lower it or not. Not too sure. <laughs> Checking the game shelf, quite a good selection there. But again, it's the usual stuff, the uh, GTAs and the sport games and the sing games. Nothing really worth picking up. Spotted like every edition of the Lego game on PC. They wanted a pound each, it was really good prices. Uh, the cases were messed up. But I looked online and there was something about DRM or something, so you couldn't play them if they're old or used. So I wasn't too sure to pick them up or not. So I don't know if you guys know if you can pick them up in the future. Let me know. So the video is over. I hope you enjoyed it. Nothing spectacular. weren't much around, especially gaming-wise. It was the same old crap. Titles again and again. Um, but what I did pick up was a Sony Walkman. As I said before, these are like 20 quid to... 50 odd quid on eBay. These go for random prices. If you hold out, you can get a good price for them. The way I see it is, is I don't really collect these, but if I see them, I'll pick them up. You know, Kieran Cox, Game Boys are awesome, said about these. You know, picking up Sony stuff, it's worth a lot of money. You know, he picks up camcorders for a couple of quid and sells them for like 60, 70 quid and stuff like that. So I saw this, I thought, I'll buy it for four quid. Charity Shop made some money. If I make a bit of money, it's more money for gaming, isn't it? So it's not too bad. But yeah, fully working. Opens like so. The uh, battery compartment, which is open at the moment for some reason, is spotless, and it fully works. So three ninety nine, not bad. It's, it's, it's you know quite a lot, not too bad. At a boot sale, you might pick it up for a couple of quid. But yeah, if you see any of these Walkmans, I think that the eighties ones tend to do better than the nineties ones. You know, the the cheaper nineties ones. These are like a more heavier duty product. But yeah, so yeah, I picked that up from one charity shop. The other charity shop, I got a couple of Blu rays. Now, Nightmare Before Christmas, love the film. Got this for the missus, really. Uh, she really loves Nightmare Before Christmas. And we've got it on DVD. We've got a special edition DVD. <clears throat> and this is the collector's edition. Uh, Blu-ray. I haven't watched it yet, to be honest. But the old films, they're all right in Blu-ray. They're not that great, but it's nice to have. And it's complete. It's got the paperwork in there. The disc is mint condition. And for a quid, can't turn that down. And in the other film is Dorian Gray. I've not even heard... Of, well, I've heard of it. I've not seen it. Nothing about it. These stickers from CEX, where it's from, are a bastard to get off. But yeah, this was from the other charity shop. And this was a pound also. But Jake Tilly, Retro Game Hoarder on YouTube, also said this film is one of his favourite ones. He said there's loads of editions of Dorian Gray, but this one's the best one, apparently. So, if it's crap, I blame you. And that's it. Nothing game-wise is... Uh, game-wise is... Nothing game-wise, um, as I said in the video, loads of shit around. But I'll keep looking. I tend to leave it every week. It seems to be uh, Friday they tend to stock up. So, yeah, Friday, Monday, I, I tend to go in there. But I, I asked them as well a few times in the shop, is anyone else after games? You know, um, This is actually not the, the only video. I actually did a second video doing all the charity shops again. But I've not included that because it was just empty. There was nothing at all. Nothing, anything changed. So all the stuff I got there, that was it. And there was even less the next time I went round. And I did ask the people, I said, oh, is there anyone else coming around for games? And they said, no. And they said, normally there's piles and piles of games sitting upstairs and they've got to bring them down. But there wasn't anything. So, oh well. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. See you in the next one.